Bro, I'm scared to be here. All right, so listen, Rich Maliki, Maliki TV, we are on the scene in the supermarket. We are about to do a rationale, double stack combi oven installation. If you've been following along, you saw us loading it on the truck and getting it all done. And now we did do a site survey, but there were things that were supposed to happen here prior to us getting here. What's go, what's, so what's going on here? What's, right what's now the situation? We've got power cords that are missing, electrical supply, but there's no power cords, no juice, no love. The gas, they opted to go with electrical, so the gas would have been here. The plumbers were going to finish the job. I would have had gas, but we're going electric. Therefore, no problems. We're going to look in the boxes and figure out if we have a motor. So what is this going to mean? Job stops. So what that means is if we can't find what we need to find here right now, this job's about to stop. And this is, this is what happens. Um, when we're trying to coordinate installations, it happens all the time. Things just stop dead in their tracks. If everything that we tell people that needs to be done before we get here, and they they commit to it, and then we call, call call and say, "Hey, did you get it done?" And they're like, "Yes, everything's here. Everything's on site, ready to go." And then we get here, and then things happen like this. Now we're not totally dead yet. We're gonna find out what's going on. We're gonna look through these boxes and make sure. Now, where the cord fails. Sorry about that. Alright, so the, that box is going to have more of that wire. In the Alright, so we just spoke with our uh, area manager and kind of gave him the lowdown on what's going on here. They have Hubble plugs here. The electrician didn't do his part really, I guess, prior to us getting here, even though this was all scheduled and confirmed which happens. So all we could do right now is stack these things, set them into place, get them all ready to go for a startup, and when the electrician comes and does his thing, we'll end up coming back and doing the commissioning and making sure everything is good to go for them. This sucks as in you gotta do the job twice, but I mean, power cords are supplied, but to the applications we have in here and by the codes, we can't actually do it. So put it in place, line it up, level it, feed it with water, make sure everything's intact. Then of course come back and do the job again. We're gonna have to come back again. So th these are things that people don't see and realize that there's cost attached to all this. So this cost, this guy's cost, these guys cost money. All right, everything that we're doing here costs money. Time is money. That's what we sell. So now we have to come back and there's gonna be more costs incurred. So this is why we like to get as much information as possible and have everybody on the same page with communication. And now these guys are gonna go to work. I'm getting down. So it's still a past. Let's go. I mean everything. They do grilled cheese, and yeah, a lot of schools schools are putting combi ovens in for, you know, for healthier options. As far as they don't need butter and oil and all this stuff, they can just put it in here, do the fries without the oil, do the grilled cheese without the butter. 
Okay. So, so they can heat everything up, plus they can make chickens in here if need be. Yeah, it's becoming like the workhorse for, for kitchens, even for professional chefs all over. It's like when this thing goes down, Good. chaos breaks, breaks off. Yeah. What we got going on here, Rich? Tell, tell, tell all the people in food service equipment land, Maliki TV, the beautiful audience watching right now. What do we got going on here? We're stacking these babies? Yeah, we're about to stack them. It's a stacking kit right here. So we're preparing it so we can put the other unit on top. Put it in place. Hook up the drain. It's too bad we can't put up the electrical so we can run the unit and do a start up. It happens. This is what happens. I mean, we, we there's roadblocks. So, you know. Least, uh, we'll get most of the work done. Majority of it will be done. You know, little tedious pieces that have to make sure they're done safely so we stack this proper and safe for everybody. Um, safety is number one, uh, right, all the time. So. All right, so we, uh, <clears throat> despite the roadblock and everything else, these guys uh, have been actually working extra, extra today. So um, I just offered to buy them a little late dinner. So there's a Spanish restaurant <clears throat> nearby, Las Palmas, something like that. So we're gonna go over to uh, Bergen Line Ave real quick and uh, grab them some dinner. These guys want some Cuban sandwiches. So um, I'm glad I'm here. You know, I'm not on every one of these installs, but uh, as we go along, I'll probably be on more and more of them. Watch step there. And uh, yes, yeah, so I'm glad I'm here to go get them some dinner. So these guys are probably hungry. They haven't eaten since this morning. So that's no bueno. We're gonna go get them some, uh, some dinner. Let's we'll hop in the car. Let's go see what Burger Nam looks like. Time, boo boo. Mm hmm. 
particular job we'll figure that out tomorrow morning and they're not gonna be able to cook right away in the morning now but the majority of the work is gonna be done you know what? We got most of this stuff set up to get, to get done we have to get done so you know you can't ask for too much more it could have been a lot worse so you could have asked for more but here's what it is so we're gonna set this in place we're out here in a supermarket, Weehawk, New Jersey. We're, gonna, we're doing a whole roll at it with uh, some supermarkets in our area. And uh, if you're watching on YouTube, you need to hit that subscribe right now so you can follow along with all the installations. You need to comment, like, share. You need to get involved and engage in your community and your industry. This is your industry, guys. I'm bringing it to you. Let's talk about it. And that's about it here. Is that 10 o'clock? I think I'm done. Let's go home. Ooh.